my literary luminaries, and welcome back to another Top 5 Wednesday. I have no idea if I've been saying Top 5 Wednesday in my outros. <laughs> this is the problem with doing these all in a row. Anywho, today's Top 5 Wednesday topic is... <clears throat> Your top five favorite minor characters. And and even in the question on the Goodreads group, there was a little bit of, you know, this can be variable on what you consider a minor character. I spent too much time making the list going, I don't, I just, is that a minor character? I don't, uh, uh, mm. So, if you don't agree that these are minor characters, you're probably right. But there's nothing saying that I'm not right either, so who knows? Without further ado, let's get started. Number one. I really wasn't sure about this one because I thought he showed up earlier, but apparently he doesn't show up till like two-thirds of the way through the first book. News to me. And that's Renfield from the Gone with the Respiration series by Leah Hable. Renfield, I know, becomes a bigger player in the game by book two. Uh, but I know at least in book one, he's probably considered a minor character, and I love him to death. So much. Wonderful character. Probably a strong inspiration for one of my characters, and I'll let you all guess which one. Um, I don't, I can't even, he's intellectual and snarky, and I think that's basically my type in characters, so. Number two. Number two is not from a book. There's a couple of these. Well, mm, there's two of these. One of them. I, this might be the only one that's not specifically from a book. Um, and it's also probably the one that most of you won't know. Her name is Aika. She's from the Persona series, which is video games. And she's predominantly in the animation, to my knowledge. Aika is the daughter of the family that runs like the ramen shop in town. She's very deadpan. I mean, no emotion, no nothing. And she does deliveries. And she will come to wherever you are. You can be running down the street and she will show up on a scooter behind you. It's just, she's so... It's the combination of, like, as... It, it's that deadpan humor that, like, Mori from Oran High School Host Club, and, like, that type of character. The very, like, this is your order. Like, how did you get here? 400 yen, please. Or whatever it is. Like, just, I don't know. Ika's, Ika's one of those tiny little characters that make everything in the scene better every time she shows up. And there's those types of characters everywhere. Number three. Number three is from the Unseen Trilogy by Stephanie Erickson. I actually had to go looking up his name, which I felt bad about. Uh, the character's name is Mitchell. Mitchell is very quiet relatively antisocial, like, doesn't... Nothing. But beneath sort of the cold, stoic exterior, he's very deep, very caring. Um, I love characters like that. And Mitchell has one of the best moments in the second book, which I won't spoil because it is kind of spoilers, but it's a wonderful story. It has to do with ice cream. That's all I'm giving you. If you know the story, you know exactly what I'm talking about. I don't know. I don't know what it is about Mitchell, but he's just... I love the character. I like him better than I like Owen, to be perfectly honest. <laughs> Number four. Number four is Tonks from the Harry Potter series. I love Tonks. She's a great character. She's so much fun. She's so so much energy that is desperately needed in those later books. And I am angry about the end of her story. <laughs> I'm angry. It's a stupid ending. Stupid. Good character deserved better. That's my opinion on the matter. <laughs> and finally, number five. This is the other one that I was going to say wasn't from a book, and then I remembered that there is actually a book of this. I just haven't read it. So I assume he's in the book, but I don't know. That's Calcifer from Howl's Moving Castle. And I don't know why Calcifer did not occur to me earlier when I was making this list. Because Billy Crystal. I mean, come on. <laughs> Fire Demon, Billy Crystal, may all your bacon burn. Like, I just, oh, 
I love Calcifer. I love Calcifer so, so much. I can't even explain it any further than that. If you know the story, you know why. <laughs> Those are my top five favorite minor characters. Um, as always, I'd love to let, like, let me know what some of yours are. Because I, I like being able to go in and look at the people that not everyone else is focusing on and see what they're contributing to the story. So let me know in the comments down below or on Twitter at KRI and Frey. As always, I love to hear from you. If you like the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. It is very much appreciated and very much helps. And hey, if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, why not subscribe? YouTube will very kindly notify you anytime that I post a new video, especially if you hit that little bell icon, which should be every Tuesday and Thursday. But until next time, I shall build you all adieu, and I will see you all on Tuesday for another Tuesday Talks. Bye! That definitely turned into not English by the end. I will be joined you for the shit next week. Bye. I don't care. I'm too tired. <laughs>